Hi, Brentech here, where tech is made simple. So towards the end of November last year, Microsoft rolled out a notepad update to the Windows Insiders, and I did post a video on this. And one of the changes was that Microsoft said it was expanding lightweight formatting in Notepad with support for tables, where you can insert tables in your document with Microsoft saying to help structure your notes. Now, I did notice with a Windows 11 Notepad update today in my region from the Microsoft Store that the tables now have made their way into the stable version. So here you can see with your formatting options at the top, you've now got your table. So yeah, you've got your columns. And yeah, you've got your rows. So as an example, if I want three columns and two rows, I click accordingly. So you've got three columns and two rows. So you get the idea. And then if you click on that again, you've got editing options. So I can delete that table or a column or a single row. I'm going to delete the, delete the table. And if I want to go the full package, five by five, so to speak, there we go. So that's five columns and five rows. And then if we head back and we just head to our editing options again, and we delete that table, you'll also notice if you click on insert table, you can manually enter the number of columns and the number of rows and then insert that. So I think that's a nice touch if you are using this feature. And if we just have a look at some of those edit table options, you can insert a column left, as you can see. You can insert a column right. You can insert a row above. If you get the general idea, a row below. And you can select a table, a column, or a row. Let's just select a row. There we go. Just to give you a general idea. And then as mentioned, you've got your delete options for the table, the column, or a row. Now, the only way to turn off the new tables is if we head into our settings, is there's no option just to turn off tables. You can only turn off all the formatting options in Notepad, but toggling this setting off, turn off, and if we head back, you can see formatting options have been removed. And obviously, if you want to place everything back, you just reverse the process. So it's all or nothing. But nonetheless, Notepad really becoming a WordPad and the simple Notepad we knew back in the day is no more. But at least with most of the options and the settings that Microsoft is pushing into the Windows 11 Notepad, at least we have options to turn off most of the features if you don't want to use all the, the extra clutter, so to speak, that Microsoft is pushing into Notepad. But nonetheless, Tables is now available in the stable version and just putting it out there in case you would be interested. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.